Hi guys, welcome back to Bump Box, and this is a kind of special, I suppose, a Poundland special, and I've based it on toys, and it's going to be called One Good, One Bad. Basically, I scoured round, trying to find, it's a bit of a tricky task, the best thing and the worst thing, considering I've only got a pound, um, the first one's a Dino Fossil Excavation Kit, and I kind of do like my mystery toys, the blind bag type toys, and it's actually even got the little hammer, chisel, a little paintbrush, um, the condition of the toy is really good. You can see, obviously, you've got your little fossilised egg character, little shell work, and you've got the little dinosaur um, little detail on there. So I thought, that's pretty cool. I mean, for a pound, similar things to this, so a lot more than that on eBay and Amazon. So I thought, well, for a pound of anyone's money, that's not too bad. Um, build, excavate, and learn. Not learning about good toys, probably learning what a pound will get you these days. Not much. Dinosaur eggs. Dig it out, kids. Dinosaur. Dinosaur fossil. Dinosaur excavation kit. Dig dinosaur egg. Educational toys. Can they think of any more words to put dinosaur next to? Dinosaur egg on toast. Dinosaur underpants. Dinosaur. 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 Get yours now. And we've got some foreign language. And I've got a bit of a detail on the back. So we have to dig our little skeleton out. We get our excavation fossil toy kit. Instructions for use. Place your fossil on a piece of newspaper. Use the hammer and chisel provided. Break up your fossil. Use the brush to clean, blah, blah. Don't make sure you put any in your mouth. And if you get any in your eye, obviously clean your face. Oh, no. Oh, I've ruined the packaging. I am so sad. Well, yet again, the egg is really impressing me. Really, well, no, I'm not blown away, but... It's a nice looking thing. So, fair enough. Uh, 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 oh, they use the sellotape. Uh, right. Uh, uh. Oh my, it's a little... Um, I know it's only a one pound toy, but it's like the... Dang, it's, it's so lightweight. That's not going to do anything. And you've got this tiny little chisel. So, uh, if a child was sat here like this... No way, that's done nothing. Nothing, that's, you're not gonna. No, that's not gonna do anything. You'd be, it'd, be like, it'd be a SpongeBob routine 44 years later. Well, I kind of had a feeling this would happen. I came prepared. Sadly, I haven't got any newspaper, so towels and kitchen roll will do. Do do do. Do do do. Do, do, do. Just a normal day, you know, you've got your screwdriver and your hammer, you know. Uh, uh, uh. Careful. Oh, oh. Ooh. Progress, we're getting somewhere. Uh, 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 uh. <sighs> Alright, imagine how long it would have took me with this thing. Uh, right. Oh, somewhere. Ooh, I see something. Uh, uh. Right. May have to throw it at the wall. Uh. Oh, getting that. Ah, come back. Right. in my dinosaur egg with a screwdriver <sighs> I was intending this video to be quite a short video <sighs> carry on come on Dinosaur egg, it does not even want to come out. Come on. Come on, dinosaur egg. Oh, we're slowly getting that. I think realistically, if this would have come with some sort of circular saw and uh, sledgehammer, then we would have been more appropriate. Apparently this toy's for five years and up. I think they're aiming at the 45-year-old bored DIY enthusiast, not the uh, six-year-old child, but carry on. Oh, come on. Oh, here we 
go. No, come on. Hey. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Look at that. Oh. <clears throat> right, you have to be careful now. This is where you have to be delicate. Oop. Oop. Ah, it's a Stegosaurus, I think, and it's missing a few of the spikes. I don't know how that could have happened. It definitely wasn't me with the screwdriver. <laughs> and nothing happened there. So, overall, that was good fun. Um, it's supposed to last a quite long time. And if you don't really like your child very much, or you're trying to get them occupied for a very long time, imagine them trying to open that with this thing. They would be there hours. Hours. Or if you're a really cruel parent, you could say, Little Timmy, or Little Janine, or whatever they're called, I bet you, £50, you can't open this egg with this little toy in five minutes. But if you do, I'll give you £50. You watch their little faces try. They're not going to do it, are they? Anyway, if you've got something good, my dear, you've got to have something bad. And we've got a warrior journey to creation figurine. I looked at the figure on the set, and on the shelf, there's about seven of these. All identical sculpts, all identical moulding, paintwork, everything. I looked at the eyes on this one, I was thinking, my giddy aunt. It looks like these, the eye sockets have been burnt out and there's just two black cavities where the eyeballs should be. And I was thinking, no, someone's just done that lazily. No, they're all supposed to look like this. This is how they've been painted. Even on the promotional artwork, on the back, there's a little one here. And I can't really bring it up closely, but it's got blackened out eye sockets. I was flabbergasted. I thought, oh, wow, this is going to be my bad one, purely because it's been painted so poorly. But nope, it's meant to look like that. Oh, it's, it's even been screwed in. Right, let's have a look. So for a start, it's either got a bleeding arm or they've just painted the face. Um, cheapy rubbish shield stick that's just been plain well, sticked on really it's just awful um, a bit of sprue or someone's hair which is disgusting knowing how these toys work I would say hair but then you've got a lot of uh, cheap glue gun sprue and material gunked into the side to hold the shield on um, you've got some sort of dog skin sheep skin wolf skin coat thing looks like a cat that's been scalped um, no articulation because it's just a figurine, but purely that face. Uh, I looked into the sun. Uh, I thought it was another eclipse. Uh, my eyeballs. Uh, uh. I'm alright. I'm alright. It's just eyeshadow. It's just makeup. Uh, yeah, go to disco. Bits, 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 bits. Awful. Look at that. <gasps> it's Thor's granddad. Uh. I'm blind. Where's my hammer? I need that. I've got two more repayments to make. No! So overall, for £2, you can buy yourself an ineffective hammer, an ineffective brush, the world's teeny tiniest dinosaur toy, and a blind man in figurine form for anyone's shelf. Wow, I feel um, really special now. Until next time, boo!